Yes, what's going on? It's been a while, but I'm uploading the video. Yes. And this one is... If you think perfection is going to work, it's really not. Let's just say it like that. Right? And this is based off of my little... Uh, blog <laughs> that I uh, wrote. You know, I started just writing a little bit, and uh, I gotta fix certain things. Is I out of nowhere they want to like monetize me and stuff, but I gotta put all that information. But it's so difficult because everything is so uh, closed in. I'm like, I cannot see anything. I cannot know what I'm filling out. But anyway. That's nothing. But I wrote down so in a spot, and I said, you know, people want perfection in these relationships, but it don't work like that, right? And really, this is for both guys and gals, I'll say. A lot of people want that stuff, but end up not being the perfect guy right like even uh let's say there, there was a show i was talking about called f boy island right and a lot of those shows are like complete bs because the cameras the lights you know the way they have everything staged they make it seem like during whatever episodes or whatever month it's like this with this person but when you go on the internet or you see on their Instagram they no longer with that person it's because when all that stuff is taken away and I said this in my like blog when they're honest about it and they had to lie they really don't understand that person it's usually with the girl like right the girl would be like oh he's everything he's perfect he has charm charisma you know he's good looking this is what the girl would say right but when you two are with each other and finances how you two react when you two are like hanging around each other not for a weekend but for like spending a long period of time with someone there's gonna be certain things you don't like about that person right guys and girls right yeah because you know women they like to you know for the guys they, they like to you know have stuff in a certain way you may not like that it may just irritate you because some people are control freaks some people are this some people are that and if you're not willing to work around that it's not gonna work out for you people and honestly, too, mental health is another thing. I didn't write that part. Mental health plays a part a little bit. There's certain people who are, I wouldn't say battling, but, you know, they're working on themselves every day. And there's ins and outs about that person that you may not like. I wouldn't say ins and outs. But there are certain things that they, they, gotta, they have an issue with and it may bother you. So all that perfect stuff doesn't really work with that at all and shout out to ams in his video he said if you can deal with five 75 percent of that person right you good with that with that person but i'm gonna say it like this it's really 60 percent if you can deal if you can put up with some stuff you can accept that person's flaws you you two can really make something happen for a long period of time. Because this, this another thing, me and my homie was talking about it. Because he was like, I don't really care about like the perfect girl with the perfect body and whatnot. And he was like, I gotta be able to deal with you. Not deal with you, but I would say be around you every day like communication is very key important doing like activities to make both of you two are better for each other right and that's very true 
Because that, that person who's got the cute face, the perfect body, all, everything that you want, it, it, may, it may make you insecure a little bit. Or may make the other person, oh, I can do better than this. They're saying you, you this and you that. And it just makes you as a person uh, feel bad about yourself. And that's why I say that 60% is really got to come in hand. Cause like I tell guys like this, let, let's stick to the fellas real quick, right? I'm sorry if I'm all over the place a little bit. You may think that girl at the gym who's the most amazing body. Oh, she cute. She oh man, she got that. She got it poking out back there. Oh man, she's everything. Get a chance to know her. Really take a deep dive into. Who this woman really is, man, you gon' <laughs> there's gonna be certain things you may not like about that woman. That girl who's a nine to you at first, she she go right down to like a five, especially personality wise and stuff like that. Yeah. You gonna really start to see who that person really is. Same way with women. Women be thinking the rich guy is everything. The the most amazing dude. He's, he's got the crazy body, you know. He he's got the ultimate car, and I, I'm gonna tell you like this: me being in the modeling industry, a lot of women want that, but they cannot have that because there's probably some inner demons that man has, or there's certain things that he does that you may not approve. And then once you're into a woman. Once your family starts seeing the flaws in that guy, they're going to question you. Why are you dealing with this guy? Why is this? But he has all the money, right? He has all the... He has all the status in his industry, let's say, in, or in his career field. But he does certain things that may not bother him. You. You sit there and allow that person to do that. You have very low self-esteem about yourself. There are women out there who are dating dudes And they know They man is cheating on them And they be like oh okay no problem But to their family They be yelling and screaming And they don't want to talk to her no more Because he does X, Y, and Z But, but the money's there yeah, yeah, A lot of these women who in the modeling industry Are dealing with guys like that Or dealing with jerk off dudes like that And I said that in my blog too Because I hear these conversations I'll be like man like man you women are sad out here <laughs> y'all women are horribly sad out here and 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 a lot of people don't understand that, that perfect stuff man the perfect is not what it is perfectionism is not what it is man. it's really not and i will say this i was thinking about this before uh I went into the gym. You know, there's people out there who put up with everything bad about their person and they still try to think they can fix it and they can think they can... Oh, I can change them and may maybe make them into a better person. Um, My opinion, my thoughts on this, it, it's not. It, it's, it's really a waste of time. Like, I even found out... Uh, one of my old co-workers is still dealing with the same disrespectful woman that bad mouth him to the co-workers right and on top of that too caused this man stress left him while he was working hard on beat on working on his position and stuff and he still took her back me personally once a woman does like does stuff like that makes you look bad or anything you you cannot mess with that person at all period like that's just a cut off right there but there's some men who who really would deal with that they'll they'll deal with a woman cheating on them and then they'll try to work it and fix it out but i'm gonna say it like this you end up miserable for the rest of your life because you know deep down inside that person really did harm towards you and there's men out there who really would try their best and Oh man, we can make it work. Oh, we can do that. No, don't, no, no, you don't do that. That's not the wave. 
That's that's not what you want to do. That's not even like trying to work on things. That's just like you got to cut that person off. Somebody disrespect you like that, make you look bad in front of others. Nah, I'm sorry. <clears throat> that was one thing I should have uh, uh, put into my book. Actually, I might put that into today's read if I have the time. But that's something you you don't want to ever deal with. And don't lie in the comments, oh yeah, I left her, but nah, you were dealing with that person for months and months and months. And you seen, and it's all the guys out there, you you seen how horrible this woman was, but you kept putting up with it because of that cute face. You kept putting it up with it because um, the SEX was amazing. Or you thought you can make this person a perfect person. No, you can't. No, you cannot. You cannot and will not. But let's just stick to the subject, man. There's a lot of people out here who think um, having that perfect pers guy or girl is worth it. And it's really not. It really sucks. And that's the end of this video, man. I'm sorry if I um, was like saying the word over and over and over again. It's just, I just woke up. I'm like a little tired. I need some coffee. That's what I'm going to go get. I got other things I got to do. I'm out.